Hey guys, it's Fryzer Good here. So, you're in a situation with a catalyst. Uh, this is a 3550. Now, you hit return. You know, you pull this out of a scrap bin or whatever. Obviously, you, you don't have a password. You know, type whatever you want in. It's not going to be happy about it. Or here, say you did have the password and you may have forgotten about it. That's okay, we're gonna go over that today. So to begin, we're gonna pull the power from the back of the device. Now on the faceplate, where the ports are at, on the far left of the faceplate, you'll see a mode button. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold that mode button in while I plug in the power. I'm still holding the mode button, uh, just reapplied power. Now I'm hoping to see an amber light or some form of an indication to show that it's not going to do the standard boot. I just released it regardless. Um, okay, yeah. On this on this model of switch, or yeah, this is a switch. Um, you don't need to hold the button down until it goes amber. You can probably just hold it down while you're plugging it in, and as soon as you see switch, or as soon as you let go, if you see switch, you know you did it right. Um, so from here, we'll do flash underscore init initialize flash. Okay, so now we can run dir flash semicolon. Oh, that didn't work. Dir flash semicolon. So here you have a few few files. Um, usually, since I don't care, I'll delete the old files. Um, but here's what we'll do uh, for people that may be in a production environment. Um, rename. Now we're just gonna add a. So what I did there was, I should have I should have told you. Um, I selected this here, and I typed it rename, and I right clicked. When you right click, that'll put uh, whatever you have highlighted down there into your shell. Um, so now we're gonna press it again and add a period old. Uh, rename Probably should have tried this before I made the video, but There we go so we'll do that same thing for config, private config, and VLAN data. So VLAN flash.
I'm just gonna pull the power. Um, or we could also do dir flash again to double check and make sure that the file names have changed. Um, so now we're gonna pull the power and restart it and hope that we can get into the device. Okay, booting the image now. Okay, looks like we have successfully reset this Cisco, uh, what is it, Catalyst 3550. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.